Jesus. innovation meaningful. What inspires us? What keeps us going when everyone else stops? How do we find meaning when there's nothing to see? What is the spark that leads to a new idea? Your obstacles, we work to remove them. Your dreams, we help you capture them. Your joys, we're driven to heighten them. Where some rejoice, we see work to be done. Where some see disappointment, we see opportunity. Some see nothing at all. We see new ways to communicate. We are the engineers of Huawei. We value the moments that shape our memories, our futures, our lives. Huawei, making innovation meaningful.
Ladies and gentlemen, the press conference will begin in one minute. Please take your seat. Mesdames et Messieurs, veuillez accueillir Monsieur Richard Yu, PDG de Huawei Consumer Business Group. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mr. Richard Yu, CEO of Huawei Consumer Business Group. Bonjour, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome you to Paris to Grand Prix. We are so big pleasure for us to be in a so amazing venue here. We launched the Huawei the P3 the flagship phone, and then today we will also launch a Porsche Dian phone with the Porsche Dian team. You know that I'd like to take this chance to express my sincere thanks to all the global media's our partners, carriers, our partners. And、uh, our global consumers, your trust and support. With your trust and support, and Huawei, the last seven years, we keep strong growth every year. And last year, we ship out 153 million smartphones globally.、Uh, we consolidate our top three smartphone supplier position, and we keep continually growing. And if you see that we start our brand journey. Seven years ago, seven years ago, almost nobody knows Huawei.、Uh, nobody knows this brand, and people cannot pronounce and、uh, don't know this brand. But seven years passed. Three years ago, we are ranked by as a top three, top 100、uh, famous brand in the world. But this year, every year, we are increasing our global brand brand ranking, and we are continuing to increase our. And the invest, we have strong, and the investment globally. And last last year we were ranked as top six, and the investment, in together with the global company, large companies. Last year we, the ranking we spend over ten billion U.S. dollar in R&D, but every year we keep more than twenty percent increase in our R&D, in our research and development. You know, we really care about the Earth, and、uh, Huawei. We adopt the eco-friendly designs, and we also win the gold medal for green certifications. And、uh, Huawei, our campus, we are using the solar power, the clean energy. We dramatically reduce the、uh, CO2 consumption. And for Huawei, you know, we want to let more consumer to touch to experience the Huawei product. So we dramatically increase our experience shops globally. 
Last year, 200% increase in Huawei experience shops. Not only increase the number of shops, but also we want to leverage the experience level. And we want to give more experience to the consumers. In, this is uh, one of the shops, uh, our experience in Italy, in Milan. You know that we not only provide the products for the consumer to touch, to experience, but also we have the lessons, the programs, and also some customer services for the consumers. So we really want the consumer can really experience more, to learn more from the Huawei Experience Store. <clears throat> you know, we really care about the young, young talent. And start from 10 years ago, we initiate the, we ini initiate the information and the telecommunication talent programs. 10 years past, every year we cover over 96 countries. This is uh, Huawei, the logo, currently. But today, I tell you that we will upgrade our logo, make it more simple, our customer-centric. This is our new logo. <laughs> Thank you. We also won the trust of, by our global partners. Here, let's see. Welcome to Paris, city of love, city of art, and by the way, headquarter of Orange Group. When we talk about love, we may also consider the partnership between Orange and Huawei. It's a long-term partnership started more than 10 years ago. Together with Huawei, we share emotion and passion regarding quality and aesthetic design. What we have in our hands is really what we love and what we want to deal with. And it has to be one of the most beautiful things in the world, and it is. Orange and Huawei, we share the passion of quality, the passion of aesthetic beauty. Huawei has been a trusted partner of ours for probably 15 years now. Um, at the time, we started with 3G mobile broadband modems and look at where this has taken us. Uh, I think last year we've sold a Huawei consumer product uh, to our customers like every couple of seconds. Huawei has obviously a very strong heritage coming from the network side, but uh, over the last few years they've clearly added a lot in terms of design innovation, more recently artificial intelligence, and if you put this innovation together, it really creates results. Like last year, for example, we've been able to break multiple speed records in many of the markets we operate in, working together between Huawei and Vodafone. We are really looking forward to continue working with Huawei to bring great new experiences to our customers uh, wherever we operate. The relationship between Huawei and Telefonica is of a great success and uh, a strong partnership. Uh, we've been working for the last 10 years to bring the most innovative products to our customers, both in Latin America as well as in Europe. We have selected Huawei as one of our leading strategic partners moving forward as well. Huawei for us is one of the leading innovators in this industry. They, they combine great design with outstanding technology. In a context in which uh, we are seeing lack of innovation, we rely on partners like Huawei to continue bringing this meaningful innovation to our products. We expect to continue the very successful partnership with Huawei for another 10 years to continue bringing to market the most innovative devices. Hello everybody, my name is Christian Stangi and I want to give this nice award to Huawei because they have achieved great performance and quality in our network over the last months. But it's not only congratulations to this great quality, but also to the great phones they're going to launch in the next days. I wish you all the best in Paris, have fun and celebrate. Bye bye. Thank you. You know, the Huawei P-Series smartphone always has the aesthetic design and with the best camera technology. If you look back the five, last five years, in every generation, the Huawei P-Series uh, smartphone is ultra slim, beautiful design, sleek, and also with the best camera in that time. You know that we win, for five continuous, we win the best smartphone award 
by ASA, and uh, we also win a lot of awards right, globally. <coughs> you see, year, in year 2016, Huawei, we, we launched P9 and P9 Plus. We partnership with uh, Leica to launch with the industry is the first generation, the first wonder in, in this industry to launch dual camera on the flagship smartphone. We reinvent the smartphone photography with Huawei P9 and P9 Plus. In year 2017, we launched the P10 and P10 Plus. We make every shot a cover shot using the new generation Leica dual cameras with rooms technology, uh, hybrid room technologies. <coughs> Today, we launched P20 and P20 Pro. Master photography powered by AI. Here is the phone. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. You know, you may be curious why we name it uh, P20 instead of P11. Because we have big jump on the new technologies. Why is it not plus instead of pro? Because this time we're really introducing professional camera technologies on the tiny size smartphone. How can we make the big bulky, the professional te camera technology on so slim the smartphone? So later I will make an introduction for you. <coughs> Huawei P20 and P20 Pro will help you to see more art, more light, and more intelligence. <coughs> this phone is designed with harmony. <coughs> and also, the, you see that design is a seamless surface, the comfortable in your hand, the sleek. <coughs> and you can see the craftsmanship in every detail in your hand. And also, you know, that's we, the design we inspired, you know, we heritage in the 5,000 years history of Eastern culture, Chinese Eastern culture. You will see that all the ancient buildings, they're purely symmetric design. You know, even uh, this uh, background is a uh, uh, Chinese palace, forbidden city. They're purely symmetric. So the, the beauty of symmetric, then we move to this phone. <coughs> you can see that in every, every corner, Every size of this phone, I want to show you that it's a purely symmetric. You, no matter front and back, left and right, they're purely symmetric. Even you, you can see that the top of the notch and the bottom of the fingerprint is uh, purely symmetric. <coughs> this is a display, maybe have some problem. <laughs> this is wrong. <laughs> This page. Uh, this phone is designed for ph photography. People, are, many people ask me, so why this phone, the logo, is horizontally? Uh, because this is designed for you to take a professional camera. <coughs> it's designed for professional photography. You know, our Andy team, that our, we have research on light and color. We really want to bring the innovative and beautiful uh, color and light uh, to everyone. We're inspired uh, by the nature. You can see the how m in the sunset, how many colors you can see that. It's really beautiful. This is the twilight. <clears throat> you can feel, you can see the gradient of the color. You can see that from different angle, the color is different. Let's see. <clears throat> Thank you. The pink gold, the fashionable fan. <clears throat> Midnight blue, elegant. <clears throat> and graphite black, bold. <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, this is a uh, the P20 and the P20 Pro 
each one have four colors for your selection. <clears throat> Not only the outside, the inside, we also have different themes for your selection. You can select the themes you prefer in the, you can inside. You can select so many things, themes for your selection. So always one suitable for you. <coughs> we'll give you more customization. <coughs> and the P20, we are using 5.8 inch RGBW, four color, four wheel display. Why the four color? The W means white. The red, green, blue, the white. The white, is, we can increase the brightness. When you, you use the phone outdoor, you can see the screen clearly. And also, it can dramatically reduce the power consumption. Even in the indoor, you use this phone, all the white background, the power consumption is much lower. You display the white, all the white contents. A white con this will be dramatically reduce the power consumption. So it, it not only can help you to see the phones, the, the pictures more vividly, but more, more clearly, but more longer battery life. And the P20 Pro, we are using 6.1 inch OLED full wheel display. It will have very high contrast ratio and also high color gamma. It can help you to see every detail and vividly and clearly all the picture, all the video. Really the good, good display, the best display panel. <clears throat> you know, P20, the same size, 5.8 inch uh, phone, but you see the more largest screen, you can see that. In more narrow battle, more compact design, help you to see more, use more. And also, we are using HD fingerprint on, on the bottom of the phones. We can using the, in the setup menu, the navigation, you can, say, you can select using one fingerprint to replace three watch your key inside the, the screen. By short tap is back, long tap is home, and the left and the right swipe is multitask. So you're using one single uh, fingerprint button, not only for unlock, but to replace three watch your key. So less is more, it's more simple, easy to use. I hope you can try this functionality in the menus, the system navigation to select this function. 11% more additional display for you to use. View more, size less, you see, <coughs> compared with others. <coughs> and also we minimize the notch. You know the notch, uh, it's a minimize the notch, not only makes it more beautiful, but more useful. You not miss other notifications with the small notch. And with us inside the small notch, we have the receiver, speaker, and also ambient light uh, receiver, the, the camera, and all the ambient the, the sensors, uh, ambient light sensors, something inside. <coughs> and also, the P20, P20 Pro support a natural tune display. You can help to protect your eyes. In the, for example, in the indoor, in the, together with the, the, the uh, condition in all light condition, it can give the protect to your eyes. <clears throat> and also, it's slim, la slim design, but a large battery. No compromise on battery. 25% more battery than the other flagship phones. It'll help you to longer battery life, but um, slimmer than all the others. You can see that. <clears throat> Thank you. And the P20 Pro, the compact and slim design, is much slimmer than the other phone. You can see 0.6 millimeter thinner, but much larger battery, 4,000 milliampere battery, huge battery inside, but still keep compact, slim, compact body. And the P20 Pro is IP67 water and dust proof, and P20. It's IP53 rated. <coughs> Give more protection to your phones. P20 and the P20 Pro, with our revolutionary camera technologies, help you see more light 
and even see more closer. Let's see. You know, the professional, big bulky professional cameras, they can really take good quality photos and videos. But it's uh, too bulky, difficult to take. And a small digital camera, easy to take, but the, the photo quality is not as good as a professional one. Today, now more and more people, they are using smartphone. But smartphone, the quality of the photos, not as, not as good as the professional cameras. But it's simple, easy to come in, to take, easy to use. But Huawei, our philosophy is, we, Huawei smartphone, we want to let the smartphone can take professional quality photos and videos. But also, more simple, easy to use with AI, powered by AI. This, this is our vision for mobile photography. The Huawei P20 and the P20 Pro, master photography powered by AI. This is the P20. P20, all new Leica dual camera. <laughs> Large pixel, 1.55 micrometer, big pixel. And also with a dual camera, Large aperture, f1.6 and f1.8. How large this pixel compared with others? You can see compared with others, it's much bigger. 22 uh, times uh, percent larger than Galaxy S9 Plus, and 61 percent larger than iPhone 10. More big size, more large size, and uh, to help you to capture. More light. This is very, very important for the camera experience. <clears throat> Here is some of the photo taken by the P20 compared with the others. You can see the, uh, in the dark area how the detail we can see. More detail we can see compared with others in the low light condition. And also this, in the low light condition, we can take in Italy, in the evening, yeah, using, using this in this month, it's my colleague they're taking. The low light condition, really outstanding performance photo, you can see that. <clears throat> and also, even in the low light condition, we can take the vivid color. This is a, a Hong Kong Victoria Harbor in the evening. You can see how good quality the, the, and how vivid color you can see. And this is photo is taken last month in Norway, also in the evening. Uh, now it's very dark. You can see that's all the detail. Maybe the, 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 this uh, display, the quality is not enough to display all the details. But actually, it's in a high quality display. You can see every detail is really vivid color. The Huawei P20 help you to, with the lack of color. We, we can help you to catch all the colors. <clears throat> and also with on the P20 and the P20 Pro, we're introducing the industry, the best in class, best front camera, selfie camera. 24 megapixel front camera. You can catch up all the details, every details. <laughs> Not only the best front camera, the sensor, the technology, but also we have 3D Facial enhancement, the 3D outline, the shaping. It can help you to have the best tuning, the best adjustment of the skin, and help you to take the best selfie. You can see that even against the light is the most difficult. When you take a selfie against light, is the most difficult thing. So you can, even in this environment, you can see P20 can take better photo. You see that. And also we have 3D portrait lighting, the unique lighting effect. You can, you can adjust that. Even, even after you take the photo, you still can adjust that, the lighting. So it really can give you a, a unique lighting effect. <clears throat> this is the amazing thing. So the Huawei P20, the best smartphone camera ever. You know the DxO Mark, the, the benchmark test. In the industry, we achieved 102 in total score. 
and the photo will achieve the 107. You know, last year, the iPhone 10 and the Mate 10 Pro, it get the highest score, the 97 points. And later, the Pixel 2, one point ahead of us. And in the last month, the Galaxy S9, one point uh, ahead of all the others. But today, we're three points ahead of them, all of them. <laughs> you know, it's very difficult to one point ahead, very difficult. But the three points ahead, that's a big, big step. So we're proud of our technology improvement. And we also, I'd like to take this chance to express the, the LACA team, all two companies, engineering team working together to have the best innovation. Thank you. <laughs> you know, this is not enough. We want to, the best of the best, a breakthrough of mobile photography. This is the solution. The revolutionary 40 megapixel LACA triple camera on the Huawei P20 Pro. Let's see the sophisticated system. Not only three lenses, but between the two lenses, you can see we have the laser transmitter and the laser receiver inside. And even in the flash, we have the color temperature sensor embedded in that. So it's really a sophisticated system. These three lenses, let's see, the main camera is 40 million, 40 million pixel, four zero, main RGB lens. And we also have 3X optical lens, 8 megapixel, and another monochrome, 20 megapixel. Three lens together, totally 68 million. The highest pixel number in this industry, in the smartphone. More importantly, the biggest sensor size. The P20, the sensor size is much bigger than the, all the others. But the P20 Pro, even bigger. You can see it's 125% larger than Galaxy S9 Plus. And unbeatable, 170% larger than iPhone 10. It's really, the, traditionally, this kind of sensor in a big, bulky, professional camera. But how can we make it? in a tiny size smartphone. We achieved it. You know, this is another big breakthrough, the ISO. The ISO is a criteria for the highest, the high light sensitivity. We achieved the highest light sensitivity. You know, the other phones only can achieve 6,400. Only big bulky professional camera. For example, like the Canon 5D Mark IV, they can achieve over 100,000 ISO. But the Huawei P20 Pro will achieve the over 100,000. <coughs> you know, that's in the actual low light condition. Even your eyes cannot see this carrot. <laughs> the other phone, you can see that. No flash. We can take the photo. You can see that, all the details. Even your eyes, you cannot see this. But we can take that. It's unbelievable. <laughs> it's unbelievable. You can see that the portrait in low light, in low light condition. You, 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 you can see that. In the low light, the portrait, we can see the, the, the girl's face, all the details clearly. But the others, it's kind of see. Uh, even the outdoor against the backlight, it's a very difficult scenario. You can see that, that, that girl's face and the background, you can see it clearly. Even the cloud, you can see that that's the blue sky, the sky and the face, every detail. And now this is another portrait in low light condition. You can see how good quality. You can see that the face and all the details, skin, the natural. <clears throat> you know the indoor, against light, maybe the most difficult to take scenario. And you see, see this girl's, you can, her face and all the background, you can see this really the vivid and clear, uh, clear, very clear, all the details. And this is a, you can take a, uh, 
this photo is taken on the street of Paris. You can see even against the light, on the dark area, you can see the detail. It's so high dynamic uh, color range, uh, dynamic light range. And a 40 megapixel help you to take the good photo against the light, the backlight, but also in every detail. You know that the P20 Pro, the world's most powerful zoom on the smartphone. Why? We have leading 3x optical room and also unique 5x lossless hybrid room. And also the best in class, best 10 times digital room. So ten, three times optical room, five times hybrid room, and a 10 times digital room. The best in the room technology. It can help you to room in in all the detail. You are using this phone, in far away, you can take the, the detail of me, even if you see the far away phone. But this in the room, you can see the, all the, the, the bird, the laser, uh, the phaser, uh, all, all the details, you can see that. The color, every, every detail you can see in far away. <coughs> and also, you can see in the room, it's, uh, how good the, the detail, the eyes, the nose, every detail, and the color. Uh, if you enlarge that, you can see that more clearly with uh, the with, uh, five times hybrid room. We catch up every detail. You know, I, I want to take the photo of this, but that's a character on the wall. I want to see that. How can I see that? I zoom in. You can see that when I zoom in, the other phone, they cannot see. But this, you can read the small character clearly. But the other, all blurred. You cannot read that. <laughs> you can see that the detail. Okay. By the best zooming to catch up every detail from how far away. Okay. <clears throat> you know, this time we also upgrade our new laser from 1.2 meters to 2.4 meters. This laser is for instant focus. We have four in one hybrid focus system. And that can achieve the 4D predictive focus we have. Instant focus with motion prediction. In the outdoor the windy area, we take the flower of this, of this small flower. You can see Huawei P20, P20 Pro, all we has can capture, can have the best focus. But in other, you lost focus back and forth, lost focus. And also we have zero shutter lag. And together with the intelligent motion detection, you can see this goes, we take a photo of this goes using three phones to take simultaneously. And you can see that our phone takes it much earlier, much quicker, much earlier. And also the hair, edge hair, very clearly. But the other phones, more late, and all the hair blurred. You can see that difference. Really zero shutter lag, super fast, and more good quality, the motion picture. <coughs> And also we can, by the double click, the volume down key, you can, you can use it, even though the phone is sleeping. It, uh, it can take in the photo as fast as 0 0.3 seconds. And also, you know that so with this color temperature sensor, and you can uh, let the, get the pixel level color op optimization. And also with the inclusive, the Leica color, the Leica photo, Leica color. You can have the, you can take expressive photos like this. It's all taken by the P20 and the P20 Pro. And also stylish photo you can take. Tasty photo, the food, okay. And with this 40 megapixel, the camera, you can take photo like this to see in every detail, in every detail clearly. If you zoom in, you see that's the de detail very clearly. With the Huawei P20, P20 Pro, everyone can take professional camera like this. All these photos taken by P20 and the P20 Pro. 
is, is a photo taken in Mexico. <clears throat> we also have another use, uh, interesting thing is 960 frames per second uh, super slow motion video. That's it again. You can see that 960 frames per second super slow motion. You can see that all the slow motion <coughs> things. You know, last year, we are the first one in this industry to introducing AI technology on the cameras. But this year, we bring the professional skills with master AI on the smartphone. One step to professional photography. And uh, master AI we, for 500 scenarios in 19 categories. The phone can recognize all the scenarios, can know the object, know, can understand the object with the new network processor inside. The AI processor to quickly processing uh, to understand the world. So with this technology, this can help you to, be, to give the best tuning for the cameras to let everyone can ha have the right skill to take the right moment. Let's see. You can see the, the logo on that. It's a recognize the scenario. You will see that. You will, you will display that. I give the automatic tuning suggestion to you. And also with AI help, you can AI assist the composition. Sometimes you take the horizontally, the picture, this kind of alignment can take the alignment for you. And also, when you take a group of photo, it can help you to frame in all the group. You know, that's, uh, for if you want to take long exposure photos, you need a tripod. Without a tripod, you cannot, your hand cannot stop shaking. In order to solve these issues, the industry invented electric imaging stabilizer. And also, OIS, optical imaging stabilizer. But these technologies, you can, you can uh, solve the issue of short-term uh, the vibrating. But for a long time, if you take the photo, long exposure, several seconds, then your hand, your candle, this all EIS and OIS all cannot work. But Huawei, we invented AIS, AI Imaging Stabilizer. With this technology, no tripod. And uh, even you, you can take an incredible uh, photo in your, with your hand by this machine learning based the multi-frame stabilization. No tripod, just by your hand to take. As long as six seconds, the maximum six seconds you can take for long exposure. You know, here is I make a comparison, the handheld night shot. You can see that the two phones together to take the photo simultaneously for long exposure. The other phone is totally blurred. You can see Huawei P20 and the P20 both can take Clearly, a photo in a handheld. And this is a photo taken without tripod, 5.3 seconds in China, Shanghai. I can see it in the evening. And this photo is a night shot, also without a tripod. This is in the industrial, German industrial, uh, in the very famous Konica Sali. I lived there 10 years ago, I lived there for three years. It's a very beautiful uh, street. You can see the how good quality, the detail. These screens, we are looking not good enough to, to display all the details. But we capture every detail, the color vividly, all the details. By your hand, handheld, to take this. <coughs> and we have many, if you are with long, more, more longer exposure, you using a tripod, we can take even more astonishing photos, like this in Paris, the famous building in the evening. Like this incredible night shot. You can see this. This is uh, in the Italy in the evening, the 
8, 8 p.m. You can see that's all the colors vividly. The mountain, the obvious, obvious mountain. And you can see that that's an error. All the, most of our color lost. You can see the difference. <clears throat> and this is a more incredible night shot. You can see that. This is Arbos Mountain. The others only can see some white dot. Now people ask me, where is iPhone 10? I, called, I can tell you iPhone 10 can see nothing, can take nothing. The other only can have a white ball, a white dot. But we can see that more than, you, even your eyes cannot see that. Your eye cannot see that, but you can see the, the sky uh, and the, the, the tree and the, the mountain. It's unbelievable, unbelievable. It's really incredible. You know this night shot with long exposure? That's in Paris. Okay. You guys know this in this city. <laughs> Because in, in Paris, many buildings, they're not allowed to, to use because the, the, all the light have the patterns on. <laughs> so you only select some, uh, some is uh, allow us to use. The night shot with longer exposure, for example, this is in Italy. How good quality this. You know, this photo taken by me. The night before I take a flight, I go to the Sinten Bay. You know, I walk there, I just take a photo in normal way, no, not long exposure, just normal photo. You know, I, after I take the photo, I astonished. Why astonished? Because I cannot, my eyes, I cannot see this red flower. It's purely black. But I take a photo, oh my God, this the red flower is there. I, I forgot that. <laughs> you can see that. Actually, so my feeling that you need this phone, it can see more than your eyes. <laughs> It's kind of <laughs> it's short exposure, not long exposure. Only uh, one eighteenth of the night. Uh. And uh, my colleague uh, and uh, in the internal use, the uh, NDP or and uh, they take a lot of night shot collections. Let's see some of the photo. They're taken by our, our employee. Oh, this is the, the photo last night I taken <laughs> nearby in, the, in this here. Uh, you can see that even the trees, you can see that in the dark tree, your eyes, you see the, all the black, but you can see that take the photo, you can see the tree. Uh, see. So you capture every detail. So Huawei P20 and P20 Pro can let everyone can take good photo. No, no need special skills. <laughs> And also with our stabilization, you can see that on the bicycle, we take this video together. You can see sir, how stable with AIS, even with the video, take the video, it's more stable. <clears throat> you know, the P20, we get a high score. The people ask me, how about the P20 Pro? You know, DxO Max, they are really the, the industry, the, the, the best benchmark comparison. This is the result. P20 Pro, we get 109 points. And, and the photo, we get 114, the video 98. 10 points the, to the higher than the most closer to us. It is really, really much ahead, much ahead. You only can overtake the others by one point, but we overtake the others by 10 points. That's a big, big stamp, big improvement. <laughs> I do believe this phone is, will be the best camera, the best photo and the best video in this year. <clears throat> the Huawei P20 and the P20 Pro, the highest mobile, mobile image standard. Today, I like to invite Mel to share, uh, the photographer, she, she's a photographer, to share her experience with the P20 and the P20 Pro. Let's warmly welcome Mel on stage. <laughs>
Thank you. Now, thank you. Thank you, Richard. You need the, you need the Just, uh, thank, thank you. Thank you. Hi. Thank you, Richard. Hi. My name is Mel Bless. I am a photographer, a fashion photographer. I'm based in London. I have delivered global fashion campaigns for clients like Fendi, for Pucci, for Gap, for Missoni, Canada Goose. Photography really is my passion. I love it. I've dedicated my life to it. It's been a lot of very hard work, but I enjoy it so much. It's introduced me to the world in a way that I could only ever have imagined. So when Huawei approached me with the P20 and the P20 Pro and told me about the collaboration with Leica, of course, I was really fascinated. Leica, as a company, has got such resonance with the photographic world. It's a company that has developed tools to take some of the most wonderful pictures, pictures that has, have inspired me personally and hundreds and thousands of photographers the world over. It's a, it's a company that produces things thoughtfully with research and real love. I actually gave my husband, who is here tonight, today, um, I like it when we got married. He's also a photographer, dare I say it. <laughs> and, you know, this was at a time when I was just starting in my career. I had no money for the bus fare, but I knew I needed to give him that camera. And, you know, to this day, I still don't know if it was more exciting for him to get that camera or marry me. That's just how much it meant to him. So to have this little lens, these optical lenses inside a smartphone, I was really, really intrigued. This is some of the examples of my professional work. And we decided to take the camera to Paris. We, obviously Huawei are launching here today, but Paris is such an inspiring city. It's a, it's a city I do a lot of work in. It's an iconic city visually, and it's got such a rich history of photography. So obviously, first stop, the Eiffel Tower, classic. And, you know, for me, the job of a photographer is to explore the world in a curious way, to try and be creative and see things in a way that is unique to you. This was just a little example of that. I like to compose with aperture, what's sharp, what's soft. And when I was using that camera, it was amazing the ability it gave me to do that. It was able to work so quickly between the focal lengths. And that's the way that I love to work. Very spontaneously, super fast, be very reactive to what's around me. And color as well was something like, you know, I love to compose with color. I think most photographers do. Color blocks, what does it mean? How I can crop around it? And of course, color is so affected by light. Low light, the bright, bright sun in, in the daytime, the beautiful kind of soft dusk light. And the camera responded so well to those little lighting conditions. And, you know, I have to remind you, I've only had the camera for a few days. So just to work with it and understand it so quickly was a real pleasure. Also, the zoom, especially working in black and white, where I love the kind of soft, smooth, dynamic range it gave me, the mid-tones, keeping the highlights, the rich blacks. And even here, when we got kind of, we wanted to shoot that shot under the Eiffel Tower. Of course, it's all blocked off at the moment. But I was able to really push in. You can see here at its kind of widest point what I was interested in, the silhouette. And then here, much sharper. It still had that beautiful mid-tones, didn't blow out too much in the highlights. It kept the richness. And that was something I really, really appreciated. Um, this shot is 
the last shot of the day and probably sums me up the most as a photographer. Um, it was just taken on the hoof, down on the ground, getting dirty, just trying something new. I've actually turned the photo upside down. But, you know, it's just my little impression was pa of Paris on the day. And that's just how I love to work. Everyone works differently. But I felt the camera really responded to my needs and gave me creative freedom to make the choices I want to do, which is what I think is the most important part of being a photographer. So after Paris, we went to London. We were shooting in my studio and, you know, fashion is what I do. And I really wanted to take the camera into the studio environment. That's where I do a lot of my work. And I love to work closely with the models. I want to make a fun, spontaneous, creative environment for them. And this was just a small shoot I was doing with a designer friend of mine. And I thought, what a great opportunity to take this camera and try it in a really professional studio environment. And I thought it worked beautifully. I love playing with color. And you know, I really want to remind you, none of these photos have been retouched in a computer at all. This is straight out of the camera. You know, when Huawei approached me to get involved in this, something I'd never done before, and having worked with them over the last week, it really struck me how they put photography right at the heart of what they do. They really seem to treasure it. And of course, you know, as someone who is so inspired by making images, that was a really wonderful experience. Um, they also spoke to me about a renaissance in photography. And I, for one, really understand that. You know, photography really used to be the preserve of a very few, um, very few professionals, a few amateurs. And now we can all take pictures and we can all start to see the world through so many people's eyes, just explore the world through images, explore the world through pictures. And I, for one, am very happy to be a part of that. So thank you. Thank you, Mel. Thank you. Thank you for making thank you. introduction. You know, that's, uh, you know, our target is we want to let every user can take the professional uh, the photos with Huawei phones. And last year, our next imaging award, and uh, over 90 uh, countries, uh, our global U smartphone, Huawei smartphone users attend that. They submit over 150,000 uh, submissions. And the, that last year's the Grand Plus winner, she's here. <laughs> can you, stand, you can stand up. <laughs> okay. Okay. You know, here is some of the photo that taken by the, the last year's the submission yet, by the next image award. That. You know, that's uh, this year, we will have another the next image award. It's coming soon, in June of uh, this year. And uh, please attend this. <laughs> you can join. You know, Huawei P20 and P20 Pro also can help you to see more intelligence. And uh, inside of this phone, we are using the Kirin 970 chipset. And inside of this chipset, we have the industry, the most powerful leading AI processor, we call it NPU, the dedicated NPU neural network processor. Compare with the Apple, the latest A11, and the Qualcomm's, the latest chipset, Snap, Snapdragon 845. And we have much stronger AI processing power. You can see the, this benchmark comparison. <coughs> and also with our machine learning uh, on AI optimization, and we also can improve the response
by 60% of the system response. And uh, the smoothly you can improve over 50% by this uh, user behavior and intelligent resource management, the prediction, and also the intelligent context awareness. Uh, so this machine learning algorithm working with AI, we can make the phone running with better performance. You know, that's the Huawei P20 and the P20 Pro also have, both have large battery, but more importantly, we have intelligent power management. And also with a low power consumption chipset together, so we can achieve long battery life. The P20, the over one day the usage, and the P20 Pro, roughly two days usage, really lo much longer battery life compared with the other flagship phones. And not only this is a long battery life, but um, also support super fast charging. Our super charge, not only fast, but more safe, reliable. We, win, uh, we passed the certification of the TUA in Germany. And also, we are 300% faster than the iPhone X standard charger. So you can really quickly to charge the, the phones. And also the AI experience, and we wanted more apps to support our AI ecosystem. And a high AI uh, ecosystem, we enhance various apps the experience. That more apps using the AI capability. And we also partnership with Google, with Amazon, with Microsoft, with the industry leading vendors. Here's one of that. This is the uh, world's first on-device prisma uh, processing using AI. You can see 3.2 seconds. The other is still waiting. So 9.6 seconds. Three times faster than AI processing. You can see that, the difference. Thank you. <clears throat> you know that you also can do the shopping on the camera by taking the objects. You can buy it on Amazon because uh, the phones can recognize the objects. It can help you find the object. Uh, the, the, the things to buy that community. <clears throat> you know, sometimes you make a phone call outside in windy, noisy area. It's uh, very difficult to make a conversation. Let's see, let's listen to other phones. Yeah, yeah. I can't hear you clearly. I went to see it just too windy. But with the Huawei P20, let's listen. Is it clear now? I'm calling you with another phone. It's better now. Would you like to come to my house for dinner tonight? Yeah, I'd like to. All right, see you then. You know, sometimes I may have a constant call uh, during my walking, so sometimes this is very useful for me <laughs> in, the, in the windy area. Windy, uh, you know, that's Huawei. We partnership with Google for so many years. And today, with Google, and we will have we will launch the world's first real Android 8.0, the Android, the latest Android version, 8, Android 8.1, and also with the latest the, the AI API, the N API we support. And also, also today, we will have the deeply customized Google Assistant in the Huawei P20 and the P20 Pro. And also, with the, uh, the, and also we are the, fir the first feature in the Android Messenger with NPO, the AI processor acceleration. And also, Huawei, we are on the first wave to introducing the Google AR call, the first wave the AR call. So today, the big honor for me to uh, invite the vice president of Google, Mr. Sabatin. Uh, that's warm welcome, Mr. Sabatin, myself on stage. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Thank you, Richard. Thank you. That's I will great. take your click here. Mm -hmm. uh, you get that. Thank you. Thank you very much, Richard. Good afternoon, everybody. I had the chance to be in this beautiful place a couple of weeks ago for a show of Singing in the Rain, which was a big success in Paris. So we still have the rain today, but I will not be singing. Instead of singing, I will give you a few words about um, Android, um, and specifically 
Android 8.1, which is the latest release of the Android platform, and it's smarter, faster, and more powerful than ever. This is an exciting step toward our vision of an AI-first mobile platform for everyone, everywhere. Android 8.1 introduces support for the Neural Networks API, which is a hardware-accelerated machine learning running to support machine learning capabilities in apps. We're inspired by the success of Android across the world and across a wide range of devices, including entry-level phones, which for many people will be their first phone and their first and only phone ever. Android 8.1 introduces Android Oreo, the Go edition, which is our optimized software for devices with less than one gigabyte of RAM. And we are happy to announce that Huawei is running Android 8.1 with their new powerful devices launched today. Thank you. What's new in this phone? At CES, together with Huawei, we highlighted Take the Google Assistant the with the Mate 10. And today, we're excited to follow up with new custom feature for the P20. The Assistant comes built into the P20. You just have to say, OK, Google, or long press the Home button and the assistant will set a reminder, send messages, or just change the settings. So Google Assistant is improving consistently. Now you can take a photo in black and white and find inspiration with what we saw earlier, or just the inspiration of being in Paris today, to take fantastic photos with the light key lenses. And later this year, we will explore new features in the P20 simply by asking the assistant, hey, Google, what's new on this phone? And then we have the messaging. We are also collaborating to make messaging on Huawei devices a lot richer, a lot more useful, and more fun. So to tell us more, I'd like to invite Drew Rowney, who is a product manager for Android Messages, to join us. Welcome, Drew. Thank you, Sebastian. Appreciate it. Hi, I'm Drew. I'm the product manager for Android Messages. Every time I travel, I'm reminded that messaging is one of the most frequent and most meaningful ways that we use our phones. Right before I came on stage, I was texting with my fiance. She says good luck, by the way. And I'm sure, like many of you, I use my phone every day for messaging. That's why we're thrilled to be bringing Android Messages to new Huawei devices. Android Messages is a modern, always up-to-date default messaging app that enables chat features with RCS, a broadly supported standard for the next generation of messaging. That means that people using Huawei phones on supported carriers will be able to send high-resolution photos and videos. They'll be able to text over Wi-Fi and data, start group chats, and much more right from the default messaging app on their phone. We're also starting to use the unique capabilities of the device to create experiences that are more fun and more personal. Huawei's excellent camera and their on-device chip mean we can do super fast foreground and background recognition and motion sensing. Let me show you an early example of some of the experiences we're building that take advantage of that technology. In this example, someone's texting me, how's the trip? I miss you. Come home, please. They get a suggestion to record an expressive effect. And here you see the foreground background separation and the effects being layered in. They can record that, send it in one tap, and then I can respond. And I can send my own expressive effect. In this example, me on a plane headed home. I'm excited to bring experiences like this to people because I think they will help them connect with those they care most about, even if they're far apart. But the part I'm most excited about is the fact that we update the app every month. So look for new features that are fun and useful coming soon. Thank you very much.
Enjoy. Thank you, Drew. So now we'll have a, a couple of words about AR. In a great day like this in Paris, I think we could do with some more fun, and this is a great way to introduce augmented re uh, reality. Augmented reality is a powerful way to bring the real and the virtual world together. AR places virtual content and useful information into the real world around us as seen through our phone's camera. This enables our smartphones to do more and therefore enable us to do more. Suddenly, computing is woven into the world around you and everything gets a lot more intuitive, contextual and fun. A few weeks ago, Google gave developers the power to build AR apps on Android, reaching 100 million phones. And we're already seeing many, many AR apps built with AirCore lending on Google Play Store. We are proud to have Huawei as one of Google's closest partners. There are some great developers who are delivering truly immersive AR experience. For example, imagine visualizing different rooms interiors inside your home with Sotheby's International Reality. Or imagine you can see Porsche's Mission E concept vehicle right in your driveway and explore the way to customize it without going into a showroom. You could even be part of a popular online game, Guns of Boom in AR, or one of NASA's spacecraft explorers bringing the solar system to your living room. You will get a first-hand experience of these here today. For those of you who will go to the movie and see Ready Player One, you can basically see some of that on your phone in the next couple of days. Everyone should get to experience augmented reality. So together with Google and Huawei, we are working to bring it to people everywhere, including China. We will be supporting AR code in China on Huawei devices sold there, which will be distributed through the Huawei App Store in China. As these technologies continue to grow, we will see more ways people can have fun and get more done on their phones. Here, to walk us through a few of these great AR experiences, we have Steve Lay, a senior director of product marketing at Huawei. Welcome, Steve. Thank you, Sebastian. Now, let's take a look at the incredible AR capabilities of the Huawei P20 series with the Porsche Mission E AR app. Now, with the start button we see on this display, let's fire up that engine. And now, I'll be using the space in front of us to bring up the P Mission E. Excuse me, I'll need a space in front of me. I need a space. And just let me move it forward a little bit to get a better visual. All right. Now, with the power of AR, we can walk around the car and look at its iconic designs of the exterior. And to get a deeper understanding into this new technology of the Mission E, let's use X-ray vision to take a look at all new charging system. And with AR, we can also take a peek inside the interior of the car to get a real feel of that premium leather work. So here comes the door open. Let's get into that driver's seat. Look at the details, and let's look out the windshield at the crowd.
And fans of the car can also enter the paint shop to get a bit different color. So let's paint our car from white to red. And there we go. Wow, both colors look great. Now, having gotten a new color paint job, let's give it a test drive. All right, there it goes. Break. All right, let's break before we run into the crowd. <laughs> All right, now, given that with this beautiful mission in here in this beautiful venue, why don't we invite Richard to come to next to the car and take a quick snapshot with the new mission need? There we go. All right. Hey. There we go. Hey. There it is. Kylie. <laughs> oh, okay. There it Thanks. is, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. That's a sneak peek into the power of AR unleashed okay. on the Huawei P20 series. Thank you. Thank you, you Steve. Now back to you. Thank Richard. you for your introduction. Okay. You know that's. Uh, And with uh, this is kind of AR technology, we really can make some uh, impressive things. But we want to bring more intelligent experience to everyone. And this phone, the P20, P20 Pro, we support a 360 degree face unlock. Even in dark environment, that is, uh, you, you see the phones is uh, very quickly unlock. You can see this immediately. When it's, uh, it's very fast. I take the phone, you see that. You can see this, 100% faster than the iPhone 10 and the Galaxy S9, the face, face, uh, face ID and the face unlock. You can see. <clears throat> and also, we provide the Huawei Share. And this function in the shortcut, uh, the button, you can, use in, you can share your video, your photo, your, your files, your content between the phones and between the phones and with the PC. No matter Macintosh PC or Apple PC or the Windows PC or the smartphone, between that, it's very convenient. Today. And also, it's all this sharing is not only super fast speed, but also free of charge. That's using the Bluetooth and Wi-Fi between these these phones and PCs. No need uh, uh, through the Wi-Fi or through the other network connection. So it's a direct transmission. So it's really convenient. And other things, uh, and uh, we have is Huawei phone clone. It's an app, and it help you to very conveniently, quickly, to switch to Huawei phones. No matter you are using iPhone or using other Android phones, both phones download the phone clone apps, and you run in these apps simultaneously. It's very quickly, you switch the phones. 64 gigabyte data within one hour. It's really quick. Convenient. The Huawei Health is an app in the phones. I use these phones, uh, uh, these features every day. You know that's uh, this one can only uh, can not only can guidance my health and also can give the coaching on my exercise. So it's very interesting and also the, together working together with the, uh, uh, you know there's a the smart watch and the, the band. Smart band that you can really can get the, the, the help for my health. <clears throat> and also, this phone, you know, last year on the P Mate 10 Pro, Mate 10, we launched this PC functionality. You plug in the Type C and uh, the interface connected to any display, no matter your t TV or your desktop or display. Your phone working as a PC. So it's very convenient to use. So today, on P20 and the P20 Pro, we also have this PC mode functionality. <clears throat> and also, you can enjoy the wireless Hi-Fi with HWA, the high resolution wireless audio. The HWA, the ecosystem also getting the leading vendors, the leading companies support, all these the leading companies support. So you can enjoy bad quality the wireless the Bluetooth audio. <clears throat> and you know that the P20 and the P20 Pro, they have dual speaker, dual stereo speakers enhance the Dolby Atmos. And they can bring you cinematic 
experience with advanced Adobe AC4, you can experience the immersive sound, sound experience, really good experience. And also, the P20 and P20 Pro, we support dual SIM card. On open market version, and each one we support dual 4G and dual water. And on the main card, we even support 4.5G, 4x4 MIMO, super fast speed, 1.2 gigabit over the 0 0.6. Double the, not only the double the speed, but more importantly, in the weak signal area, you can achieve the good signal with four antenna. So, and also we bring the, the beautiful company, companies, like these fashionable premium covers, and the real leather covers, and also the fashionable the case for your selections. And also, we have, sorry, uh, we have a variety of accessories for your selection, including the smart covers, and also with some soft touch covers. And this is the Huawei, the first Huawei TWS earpieces, true wireless stereo earpieces, free buds, Huawei free buds. We are using in-ear design for better noise isolation. You can experience this later. One charge for 10 hour usage. It's very convenient. It, uh, compared with uh, the other, the AirPod, uh, it's a different, uh, different design. It can help you to listen to have more noise isolation. Another thing is this, uh, active noise cancellation earpiece, uh, earphones by us. It's using Type C. You don't need the charging, the, don't need the battery and the charging. It's just type, type C connection. And when you take the public transportation in your car, in the subway or in the airplane, you can listen to music in a quiet world. That's a really good experience. I take this every day in my, in my bag. So one day. It's a really good experience for me. And also, we have the Huawei Moonlight selfie stick. You can flash <laughs> under the sticks. <laughs> it's small things, <laughs> okay. And uh, Huawei Band 2 Pro. This small band, but they have the embed GPS for field trial, for field, uh, and also the real-time heart, heart, heartbeat, heart rate monitoring. So they can guidance and, uh, the health. I use this every day. It's, it's water and dust proofing. You can take it to any spots, even to the swim. So it's water and dust proofing. But also, you know, this, uh, it can tell you that your heart, how about the heartbeat? It gives the protection to you. And also, you can check your sleep. When you're in the evening, you take it. And when you're sleeping, you take it. You can check about your sleeping status. And this has a long battery life. For me, I use that one charge for near two weeks usage. It's really long battery life. It's small and tiny, but the long battery life is very convenient to use. Oh, sorry. <coughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is a P20 series phone. <coughs> Thank you. Meet the Huawei P20 and P20 Pro. The smartphone designed to help you see more. That's because this is a professional camera powered by AI. One that sees the world in a whole new way. So you can too. Rain or shine. With extraordinary low light sensitivity, your photos in low light are now perfectly bright. And they keep getting better at night without a tripod. Hold it, hold it. Beautiful. And now you can zoom closer than ever before. With the power of AI, nothing moves too fast to stay in focus, even her. It can turn a moment into an eternity. It knows which kind of scene you're trying to shoot and the right frame too. Perfect, that could be in a gallery. 
with an array of built-in lighting modes. It's also like having a pro studio in the palm of your hand with a battery that can finally keep up with you. So how's this all possible? With this, a professional photographer, all in one tiny chip. Mastering photography has never been so simple. It's time to see more. Thank you. You know that so we also want to bring more luxury to everyone. And uh, we partnership and uh, with the Porsche GI. The last year, you know, we launched the Porsche GI and Huawei Mate 10. After we launched, we received very good consumer feedback. This year, we, today we bring the Porsche GI and Huawei Mate IS. Discover the exceptional. You know, that's uh, why you call it the RS. RS is racing sports. It's from the sports car. The name. Today, it's a big honor for me to invite the CEO of Porsche Giant, Dr. Young Baker. Let's warmly welcome Young Baker on stage. <laughs> uh -huh. Thank you for coming. Maybe we can take a photo together <laughs> of this. Have you taken your phone? No. No? Okay, this is for you. Okay. Uh, I don't need it. So thank you, Richard. Thank you very much for uh, having us here in this wonderful hall in the heart of Paris. It is my pleasure to present our third generation handset in cooperation with Huawei. The new Porsche design Huawei Mate RS it's the latest result of our successful cooperation and the hard work our design and product teams have invested in creating this unique device. That takes me back to 2014 when all of this began. The starting point of our success story with the Porsche Design Huawei Mate series. When Porsche Design and Huawei first came together, we shared a common goal. We set out to revolutionize the smartphone market. For us, it was therefore crucial to start this new chapter of Porsche designed smartphones with a partner striving for the same common goals while valuing our heritage and philosophies. Since the foundation of Porsche design back in 1972, we have become synonymous with technically inspired exclusive lifestyle products carrying the move of Porsche to world beyond the automobile. Be it the world's first matte black timepiece or the invention of the iconic P8478 aviator shades, which, by the way, celebrate their 40th anniversary this year. So our products stand for precision, perfection, sophisticated design, and technological innovation. These are the same criteria we emphasized while writing the next chapter of Porsche Design smartphones. Today, with the launch of our new Porsche Design Huawei Mate RS, I can honestly say that with Huawei's engineering expertise and market-leading innovations, we found the perfect partner to make this an amazing journey for both parties. Drawing on this shared heritage, I am honored to present our new flagship device. It is the perfect embodiment of the signature design language of Porsche design and Huawei's best-in-class technology and craftsmanship. Along with the two previous Huawei developed models, this flagship device takes us one step further. I would even say we set a new standard in mobile luxury. With a Porsche design Huawei Mate RS, we created a sophisticated device that encapsulates the future of mobile technology with an exceptionally streamlined design. It achieves incredible natural beauty through accurate engineering skills and the simplicity of its design. It is perfectly symmetrical from top to bottom, left to right, and front to back. It is an expertly designed, made without compromising functionality or performance. 
This is reflected by the smartphone itself through its glossy finish, perfect hand, and equal balance of form and function, making it the ultimate device user can be proud to carry. The new Porsche design Huawei Mate RS, full of the most advanced technology, includes a revolutionary new triple camera, all packed into an elegantly designed smartphone. Through the phone's innovative black exterior, exciting software themes, and exclusive accessories, the Porsche design Huawei Mate RS is probably the best device money can buy. The high level of performance is also stressed in the name of the device. The terms RS stands for outstanding racing performance in the world of Porsche motorsport. If I had to compare the Mate RS to a current Porsche, I would definitely say it's the 911 GT3 RS of smartphones. It's a truly powerful machine with an impressively stylish exterior and, of course, interior. In conclusion, I would like to stress how proud I am we were able to accomplish all of this by taking our partnership to the next level. Working together more closely and intensively than ever before has paid off and enabled us to present the device which per perfectly fuses the DNA of both Porsche Design and Huawei. And now I would like to hand over to Richard, who will give you an in-depth presentation of our new Porsche Design Huawei Mate RS. Thank you very much. Thank you, Ian. Before you leave, let me take a, take a photo together for the <laughs> phones. You know, we launched the, with a totally the new design of phones, the Porsche Design Mate RS. It's a, it's a very unique the product. Okay. Okay. Thank, thank you. you. Thank Richard. you. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. I, I switched this thank one. You. This one for you. Okay. You know that's uh, the Porsche Giant Huawei Mate IS. We want to bring you the future of luxury, and also the future of technologies. You know this phone is 8H 3D curved design. It's really difficult to do. You can see that, and also beauty of symmetric. Purely symmetric, all the elements. And also, this phone has the 16-inch 2K curved OLED display and black premium, <coughs> premium black, and red, the desire, the luxury. <coughs> and also, this phone has the highest performance, the highest specification. It's the industry. The first flexion which have 512 gigabytes the memory storage, and also the IP67 water and dust is, uh, proof. It's the highest <coughs> in this industry. And also we bring you the real premium leather accessory, including the smart cover and the back leather cover, the true leather accessory. <coughs> and this phone also bring you the future of technologies. The, the Huawei, a Porsche Design Huawei Mate RS is the first flagship phone in this industry using the, the aero cooling technology, the micro cell, uh, micro capsule technology. It uh, can let the phone not only for cooling, but also let them, the phone have better performance, lower power consumption with this cooling technology. And also, we introducing the innovative, the in-screen fingerprint. When your phone, your, 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 your finger is nearby, nearby the, the closer to the screen, it will light up. So the, all this kind of the fingerprint, the in-screen fingerprint, is make it very convenient for you to use. <clears throat> and also, we have dual fingerprint. In on the back, we also keep the traditional fingerprint. So we have. A, both front and back, we have dual fingerprint. So in front, the fingerprint here, you can see that, and the back here. And also we support the face unlock. Once I see it, the phone is, is unlocked. It's very convenient, very quick. So dual fingerprint, and also with face unlock. 
to give you more choice, more conveniently. And also, the same technology, uh, like a triple camera, the same technology with uh, the P20 Pro, the most adv advanced the camera technologies. <clears throat> and this phone, the hand-free, the, the music is, the quality is really amazing. Due SLS speakers on these phones, and super linear sound system with a Dolby Atmos. When you, after this launch, you can try it. You can try this. The how good the quality is the hand-free, the music system. <clears throat> and also we bring the quick charger, wireless charger, 10 watt wireless charger, 80% faster than iPhone 10's the wireless charger. And now this phone have a large battery, 4,000 mAh battery. And also we support Type-C. The inbox we support Type-C, the four, four and five amp super fast charging. This is a Porsche Dine Huawei Mate <clears throat> yes. Thank you. You know, you know, today we bring the Huawei the P20, P20 Pro, and the Porsche Giant Huawei Mate IS. And you may want to know that the price and available. The price for the P20 is 649 euros with the high spec here, 128 gigabyte. This phone will be available from today, after launch. <laughs> you know, we're proud of the, our team to optimize our software. We make the four gigabyte memory. It's uh, the better than the other one that's six gigabyte with our software AI and software optimization. So 120 gigabyte and upgrade the, the storage for the price the same with the last generation. You can see that. <clears throat> And the Huawei P20 Pro, the price, 899 euros. It uh, will be available from beginning of the next, next month Eight, uh, with 128 gigabyte and 6 gigabyte the RAM. <clears throat> and the Porsche GI Huawei Mate IS, here is the price. The most is a luxury. The high performance and the luxury. So there will be the, the really the, the best luxury smartphone in the world <laughs> with the highest performance. <laughs> and here is uh, the other product uh, price: the free buds and noise cancellation, the earpieces, and also the band two. Here is. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for your coming. Thank you for your attending uh, this uh, product launch. And then we have two booths for you to demo, to have a trial. Left and right booth. Please enjoy and, uh, the experience. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>
Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us today. Now you may follow the guiding map shown on the screen and start to experience the wonderful features brought by the brand new Huawei P20 series. See more with AI, it starts now.
Meet the Huawei P20 and P20 Pro. The smartphone designed to help you see more. That's because this is a professional camera powered by AI. One that sees the world in a whole new way. So you can too. Rain or shine. With extraordinary low light sensitivity, your photos in low light are now perfectly bright. And they keep getting better at night without a tripod. Hold it, hold it. Beautiful. And now you can zoom closer than ever before. With the power of AI, nothing moves too fast to stay in focus, even her can turn a moment into an eternity. It knows which kind of scene you're trying to shoot. And the right frame, too. Perfect. That could be in a gallery. With an array of built-in lighting modes, it's also like having a pro studio in the palm of your hand. With a battery that can finally keep up with you. So how's this all possible? With this, a professional photographer, all in one tiny chip. Mastering photography has never been so simple. It's time to see more.